Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome back to another episode of Carvaco Hacks. Carvaco Hacks is a short video series that teaches you tips and tricks on the Carvco software. In today's hack, I'm going to creatively show you how to cut something out of an STL model or relief model to use in another model. For this example, I'm just going to import this eagle inside this flag. We're just going to paste it down. Now, what I'm going to demonstrate is how to cut the eagle out so that we can use that in another project. I'm just going to go to my polyline tool and we're going to make sure that we have our smooth polyline checked as well as add to existing line. And we're just going to start by zooming in and we're going to trace this out. Now I'm just going to follow along at the base of this eagle's head and it doesn't have to be exact. The closer that you get it, the smoother that it'll look, but it doesn't have to be exact. I'm just clicking along fairly quickly. And now that we have that traced out, we can go back and do any minor adjustments with our node editor. Okay, and once you've got everything traced out exactly as you want it, all we have to do is close our polyline tool. We're going to go up here to, this is the zero inside of vector. We want to hold our mouse button down over this and go to our zero outside of vector. When we select our zero outside of vector tool, this is going to zero everything outside of that STL model. Now we have our eagle head cut out. Now we could export this as a triangle mesh and save this as an STL. We also can go up here to file, save as, and I'm going to go to, it's under your My Documents Carvco, the Reliefs folder, and this one I'm going to put in my Animals folder. We'll just call this one Eagle Head, and we're saving this as a dot art file. Now once I save that in my folder, anytime I go to my relief clip art library and I come down to my animal section, we'll have our eagle's head ready to import and paste. And we can merge this into any project. For example, I've imported this wavy flag and now if I want to merge in that eagle head, I can just navigate to the animals in my clip art library and bring in that eagle's head. All we have to do is resize it, and depending on which merge function works best, uh, for something like this, probably the replace function so that we have just the uh, eagle's head. And we'd want to try and make it so that it was about the same height as the top of the model. We rotate it around here, even with the tops of those waves. And then when we paste it down, it will merge right into that flag, just like so. And that's the cookie cutter hack for Carvco Maker. Thanks guys, see you on the next one.